Saliwat, mayong gabi, mga uto naman kay Kristo. Subong, ang ato naman na tupiko, ang mga continuation sa ato nga last three topics nga amo ang personal transformation, ang um, beginning the journey, kag God works inside out. Kag sa ikaapat na ito nga tupiko, amo ang the Bible, a word for all ages. How am I doing on our topic four? Can you confidently make the following statements? First, I am certain that by faith I have 
been born again. I've come out of darkness into light. Remember, our assurance is based on the fact of God's promise, not on how we feel. Second, my focus is on the here and now, not where I've been and not on what the future holds. And third, I have entered into a new and a personal relationship with Jesus Christ. He loves me and He is changing me from the inside out. We'll be coming back to these themes from time to time. Now, I want to introduce you to a book, the Bible. It must become your friend and lifelong companion. Words are important in any culture. They are how we communicate facts, ideas, instruction, encouragement, and correction. It shouldn't surprise you that God will communicate with you by words. He even referred to Jesus, his son, as the word. You will see that in John 1st. The Bible consists of 66 books, a collection of history, poetry, letters, and the accounts of those from whom we can learn valuable lessons. It is the number one means by which you can learn who God is, how He wants you to live, and how He will help you. I didn't always view the Bible as the kind of companion before I committed my life to Jesus, I found it confusing, even mysterious. Part of the problem was that I tried to read it like, in, like any other books from page one. Soon, I got bogged down and put it aside. After I became a believer, the Bible began to come alive. I started reading one of the four Gospels in the New Testament on the advice of a friend and discovered a wonderful account of the life of Jesus. I found it very real, very transparent. I became aware that what I was reading was producing hope in me. I discovered lessons that applied to where I was right then. In fact, Often what I would read each morning would apply directly to events happening that very day. More than once I recall saying, that's amazing. Show me your glory. 
Yeah. 